Hi, this is Kyle from Unitco and welcome to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I will tackle how to apply security deposit stone invoice in QuickBooks Online. So, what are security deposits? Security deposits is an amount of money that a renter pays when beginning to rent a property that can be used to pay for any damage the renter causes to the property. So basically, in the landlord's point of view, Security deposits are liabilities, not an income, because they are refundable and deductible if there is no damage to the property after the rent period. So how do we set up security deposits? First, we're going to make a new liability account for security deposits. So in order to do that, go to accounting, chart of accounts. Click the green button that says new. And then click liability. Select account under other current liabilities. Tax form section. Other current liabilities. Account name. Security deposits. Description, security deposits, okay. click, click save. And the next thing that we're going to do is, in order for us to apply it to an invoice, we should add security deposit as services. And to do that, go to sales center product and services click new click service name security deposit deposits an income account as I've said security deposits are not an income it's a liability so um, we're going to put the liability account that we made earlier security deposits so after that click save and close and after we set up the liability account and service we can apply it now to an invoice and to do that click plus new select invoice Choose the customer, choose or add the customer that you want. In this case, we're going to choose Diego Rodriguez. And here, product services, security deposit. Description, security deposit, invoice. For example, the security deposit is two thousand five hundred dollars. Two five. Then this is not taxable because this is not an income. Check that and the terms. Click June receipt <clears throat> and the invoice date. Uh, for example, the current date on uh, July fifteen, twenty twenty two. So. Save and close. And that's it. That's how you record security deposits using an invoice in QuickBooks Online. Thank you.